Where's Angle? Do, 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 do. Hello there, folks. Ah, hello and good day. Good day in the Viking tongue. I am here today to tell you a story and another tale on the channel. Oh yes, we do love a good folk tale on this channel. And so, before I begin, sit down, relax, take a few minutes out of your busy life. Now, today's tale is an old English folk tale and revolves around a character called Jack of Kent. This story, this folk tale is called Jack of Kent and the Pigs. And it has the theme of the devil that you all know that the devil never wins in these stories. Ha ha! Take that, devil! And so, one day, Jack of Kent, he's a right character. You could call him a proper geezer. He was out, you know, walking down the road, and he was heading to market. And who do you think he met on the way? Well, it wasn't Eggle Thorson. No, it was indeed the devil. And Jack, he was a wise young man, and he knew it was the devil, because the devil had some horns, and he also had two of them feet, feet like a goat. And they got talking, as you do. You know, you want to be polite and on the road. You don't know who you're going to meet. And he said, hello there, you must be the devil. I'm Jack of Kent. And the devil said, ha ha ha, hello there, Jack of Kent. I am the devil, and I want you to go and buy me some pigs. I love my bacon. And after a few minutes, Jack agreed to do this. He was a kind man, was Jack. But Jack said, what pigs do you want? Because I want some pigs myself for my farm. Do you want the ones with the curly tail? Or do you want the ones with the straight tail? At first, oh, the devil sat, stroked his evil chin. Ha 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 ha! Ha! Laughing. And he said, I want the ones with the curly tail. Ha ha! It was, it was, it was the devil. And so Jack said, OK, I'll go and buy some pigs. And I'll meet you at that bridge over yonder. That means over that way. And... You will have the pigs with the curly tails, and I'll have all the pigs with the straight tails. And so Jack went, he brought some pigs with his own coin out of his own purse, or pouch. And on the way back, he had some beans, some peas in his pouch, a pouch of them. And so he gave them all some beans. In fact, they were straight peas. And very suddenly, something very peculiar happened. In fact, you could say it is supernatural. All of the tails of the pigs suddenly all went straight and Jack went wow what's happened here and there he knew that he had bested the devil and so he met the devil on the bridge he said oh all the pigs the tails they're not curly they're, they're straight so they're all mine the devil put his fist in the air and said why oh, you got me and I want some more pigs you must go back tomorrow and buy some more pigs and we all split half and then Jack said to the devil, he said, well, what um, pigs do you want this time? Do, do you want the ones with the curly tail? Or do you want the ones with the straight tail? And the devil, thinking that he was very wise and cunning, he said, I will have the ones with the straight tail. Ha 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 ha! Laughed and walked away. And I will meet you here tomorrow by the bridge at noon. That's when the sun is highest in the sky. And so, again, the next day, old Jack, well, in fact, he was young Jack, but some say he was a lot older than he looked. He had, got up. He had a nice porridge breakfast with some mead and went to the local market. He went there again and brought a load of pigs. In fact, he brought 20 and he was escorting them back. When he, he, he suddenly realised he'd he gone the wrong way. In fact, he's got to go this way round and over and through a stream to get back to the road. And so he did this. He thought it was too far for me to turn around with these pigs and go back to the main road. In those days, there weren't many road signs. You can get lost very easy. And all you had was the navigation of the stars and the sun and your knowledge of the local area. And so... Jack came to the stream, but the stream was quite high, and he was worried about the pigs. And, well, you know, what do you think happened? Well, Jack got the pigs, and he got them through the stream. But again, something strange happened. In fact, it was said to be supernatural. When the pigs had gone through the stream, all of the tails went straight. And Jack again knew that he had bested the devil. And again, he met the devil on the bridge. And they said to the devil, he said, Ha ha! I said, all oh, the tails are now straight, and the ones which you asked for to be curly. And there are none. And the devil went, Oh, you bugger, you got me again, old Jack! 
Oh, he went off with a big huff and a big storm. Oh, I'm going to get you one day. And that is the end of the tale. And that is how Jack beat the devil with some pigs. If you like this tale, then please share it. We do love a good sharing of this content on our channel. <laughs> and if you want to leave a comment, then please do. Now you can leave it hashtag folk tales, or you can just leave a comment in the old traditional way. And for me, Braggy, it is time to say goodbye. I've got to go. I have more folk tales to record and some food for my dinner. I'm having bacon. Leave a comment, folks. And don't forget, like the video. I'll be looking very bright there.